it's already flowing, but we're gonna. Hey, what's up, you guys? You made it back for yet another episode out here in the Beaver Chair Dam area. As you can see, we're getting ready to cut this tree. Um, I wonder if I want to cut it, and I know some of it probably gonna drop off and float down that way, but. I might try and cut it uh, where it will be pieces that drop off. I believe that's the end of it down there. So we're gonna start on this end. Got my new chain on there so it should cut like butter. I had it running before I left the house. Don't usually take that many pulls for my baby. All right, come on, baby. <laughs> I, I guarantee you, you can ask anybody in the comment section, they ain't never seen me pull on it this many times. Never, I ain't never pulled on it this many times. Even from a cold start. Maybe that's what I should have done. This is an easy pull, so. What's going on, baby? What's going on, baby? <laughs> I'm gonna be done. Oh, come on now. Don't do this to me. I'm gonna be done wore out before. It might be time for a new sport plug.
we got there. Oh, my new chain in the water. Now, wait a minute now. This is too much. This is too much destruction. <laughs> oh man, that, that's waterlogged and heavy. Turn it over and cut it on the other side. You can get us a few pieces. Can't be much more to cut through. too well let me let me try something else here guess we gonna have to muscle up try to get it out of the water <laughs> I need to cut that part of it anyway, but I bet you it ain't gonna be still. <clears throat> Might can roll it out if I get the saw out of the way. Wow, I keep getting bored. Bubble, butter water, beaver water. My gloves. Okay, I can cut that right there. I see where it needs to be cut. able to flip this up now keyword is should Man. 
man, got to buy some new gloves today. There we go. I'll cut that again. I'm gonna cut. I'm gonna cut that off over there too, even though it's gonna be in the mud. So. I need to try to, I don't know, maybe cut that in half. That jerk is big, because it's close to the butt. Close to the butt. It is the butt of the tree. Y'all remember, y'all remember in New Creek, how y'all was telling me about the waterlogged trees and how they're hard to cut? I'm not about to wear my chain out on that one. No, I'm not. It'll actually be just fine there. <laughs> I am gonna cut this though. Whew. Let me move these over here before I move these because I'm gonna have to back y'all up so you can see see us working right here. Ugh. Oh my! That little booger got some weight. Whew.
Okay, that's that. Shaking my head in capital letters. <laughs> I did not have the GoPro recording, you guys, when I just moved that wood. But I was recording with my phone, so I will insert that right here. All right, I ain't going far with these. Matter of fact, in that hole right there, I probably shouldn't put it in that hole because if the water gets high, it can easily, easily float away. But it's cut up, so that's the biggest thing. <clears throat> Fill in the hole. And this piece here. Wow, it go, oh, this thing is longer than I thought. It goes up under the. <laughs> that like to been tragic. Wow. It's breaking up. I think we just let that one be. It's not in the way no more than this dirt is. Yep. Good deal, you guys. We are done here, man. Guess I'm gonna get packed up. I do wanna see how things are looking back there, but wow, I got that chainsaw with me. And I'm definitely not about to carry that joker all the way around. I'll figure something out. So yeah, that was that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to continue getting packed up and we'll get ready to make a move somewhere. I'm going to leave the saw right there and I have just been dying to try and I did it before. I had did it without you guys one time, but I want to try and get to the snake dam from here. I think we can do it maybe. I just got to find the best route. Oh boy. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, you guys. I mean, the water is actually, y'all see the water still got good flow to it. So it's not, it's actually not as low as it was that time that I did it without you guys when we was out here one time. So I don't know, man. I might have to change my plans for real. Oh, good gracious spider web. I might not can do it. Oh boy, I don't think I can. No, I don't. Uh, oh man, it's right around the bend there. But, uh, oh boy, you guys, we're gonna be a little, we're gonna be a little, uh, oh, if I can get past that right there. Oh, oh, oh. <gasps> <laughs> oh boy, if we can get past this right here. Oh my goodness. <sighs> oh gosh. Oh, help us. <gasps> Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, we're going. We're going. <laughs> oh, and we're sinking. We're sinking sand. <gasps> we're <laughs> oh, this is so sketchy. <sighs> but I feel the bottom. Even though I'm sinking through the loose silty type dirt i feel the bottom i'm gonna walk along the banks here ah. oh oh my oh that 
looks deep. That looks deep. It's deep with mud. I'm sinking. Oh my goodness. If we can get past this, we'll be there. But the tadpoles. I'm not gonna go around that way. I'm gonna come out right here and we're right at the dam. We're right at it. I gotta crawl out. Sorry about that. Here we are. At, uh, I'm, see how much water's still flowing? Wow. You know what? I forgot that there was, Dan told me, and I think I told you guys that there was a big dam. Uh, we've never been to it, but I think Gator Creek flows into it before it gets here that broke out. So I guess all of that water is just constantly flowing through here. But anyway, here's Snake Dam. That might be where the beavers have all recruited to. Because I'm pretty sure that that was probably a big, big, big dam. A big, big dam. Uh, I'm really amazed at how much water is still flowing. A bunch of this right here is just loose stuff. Hmm. Hmm. We made it, you guys. I don't like that right there, though. I do not like that. But that water level, is, it is low. I think we had to go because it started raining, right? But anyway, okay. Alrighty, we gonna put out some of this stuff. I really can't remember if, uh, if I had left it like that right there, man. That's uh, quite a bit of stuff. It is pretty clear over there, though. I guess the other thing is, I had it directed mostly that way, and I might have been throwing it that way, I don't remember. Thanks a lot, beaver mud. already flowing but we're gonna help it flow a little better <laughs> I'm waking up the mosquitoes I got the thing on over there but I think the wind is blowing the other way it'd be nice if it'll blow this way <laughs> blow some of them this way whoa a lot of stuff I didn't throw that far, no.
Wait, wait. I thought I tucked you in. Put my strings in the beaver water. Of that hitting me in the face, and you two, and you three. Hey, I don't like stuff brushing up against me. what that is, but it's pretty major. Oh, big old gallon nipper. Sometimes I don't think they care about mosquito spray. much better. Mm. 
much, much better, you guys. We're gonna let that do. We're gonna let that do. After one more pull. Alright. We are going to go back this way so that we can inspect the creek and then we'll grab the chainsaw. Have to make sort of like a circle to go get the chainsaw. Ugh. But I definitely want it to go this way. Y'all see I went around that way. I didn't want to go through the water. <laughs> that gets sort of deep over there. Man, boy, them mosquitoes flying and buzzing around in the ears. Ridiculous. It looks sort of more flushed out. We did come back here, I can't even remember, since the uh, the 10 inches of rain from the tropical storm, right? I don't remember. I do not remember. I think we did. It just looks so different though, right now. I guess because the stuff is more dry and ashy looking. You can really see the water lines and where it was. Oh, the mosquitoes. Oh my gosh. I don't need to be back here, man. I do not need to be back here. Oh gosh. Oh boy. Wow. Joey. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. <laughs> That's flowing good, so thank God for that. Oh man. Oh, these mosquitoes. Oh, man. I'm keeping it moving. Ah, I'm ready to... I should have... Uh... There's a spider web. They bite me on the face now. I should have uh, brought the belt thing for that mosquito repeller so I can walk with it on my hip. But I don't know how good it is me walking oh spider web and if it would be effective yeah we got to go back over here this is the guitar dam area look how low that water is I might have to put some off on my face. I'm gonna become the mosquito man. Wow! Lord have mercy. Uh, that was quick, wasn't it? Maybe be walking fast because of the mosquitoes. Oh my goodness. I'm, I'm tempted to leave out that way. I really do want to leave out that way. Wait a minute, you guys. Oh my goodness. I got to put some off on my face. I don't like to do that, but I got to do it. I got to do it. Okay. Man, I'm really debating on whether or not I should do this or not. Oh boy, we're going to try it. We're going to try it, you guys. We are going to try it. Oof. 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 It's quicker. Let 
Yeah. When we first ever discovered the dam, this is the way we came. Check it out. Water was all over there, man. This is Beaver Dam here. Goes all the way around. Water level looks good. Looks very good. And y'all are about to get a nice glare. A very nice glare. <clears throat> Wait a minute. Oh shoot. <laughs> this ain't right. I don't think. I'm supposed to be over there. Yeah, I'm supposed to be over there. I'm tripping. It's so daggone low. I meant like the water level is so, so far down. Can't tell where to walk. <clears throat> wow. It flushed this right here out. Wow. Wow, I gotta be careful. I don't know how deep it is. Struggle is real. I knew it was gonna be like this too. Uh, uh, at least we've made it this far. Oh, it's probably but Okay, no, maybe not. That chair, the chair is somewhere up under this mud. Never to be seen again. Never to be seen again. Y'all see it from this view? <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Let me see. It's getting back to normal, the way it's supposed to be. Let's see if we can get out of here without drowning. <clears throat> without drowning, you guys. I'm afraid this right here may have gotten a little bit deep. Oh boy, oh boy. This ground is unstable, you guys. The ground is unstable, you guys. Oh, and the potato rake is hung. If we, oh, we stay right here. If, if we stay right here. Uh. Okay. Okay. Oh, what's that? A fish? All right. We made it. Thank the Lord. And look, the pile has burned some. I don't know if I want to walk that way. Uh, Got to be careful. Because if I don't want to fall in the fire, I don't want to fall in the fire. Uh, okay. Wouldn't have been so bad to carry that saw. Oh boy. Look, look, look how much is burned. Good. Matter of fact, I'm gonna pull some of that stuff down on that right there. Cause that right there was hot and burning. See if I could push some of that stuff on it. Okay, let's pull down. You know what? I did that wrong. I should have strategically placed that stuff down there. But it's too late now. I, yeah, I messed up. I should have strategically placed it like the beavers.
there's a possibility it could uh, burn some more. That'd be nice. Well, I guess we did accomplish a little bit as far as burning is concerned. Yep, that'll do, you guys. That will definitely do. Be nice if I had some more lighter fluid. It's just gonna take it to have to dry out some more. Guess we gonna wrap it on up, man. You know, I was just thinking about how when we was crossing the beaver trail dam here, and I said that the ground was unstable. All right, now smoke, don't smoke me out. I'm trying to talk to the people. <laughs> but, uh, you know, we, we are living in a world and it's always been like this. Really nothing has changed. It's just the fact that people are more often put in their trust, their faith and their hope in the wrong people and the wrong things. You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying it's a bad thing, you know, to be able to trust somebody, but our hope, our faith, our trust ultimately lies in God. That's where our faith should be. Now, of course we have people such as myself, you know, who may lead somebody to Christ or you know, somebody may look up to me or something or somebody, you know, that has been influential in your life. You shouldn't put your hope and your trust and faith in them so strongly that if they mess up, that you don't want nothing to do with God. Your relationship with God through Christ Jesus is what is going to cause you to have a firm foundation. That's what you should build upon. Jesus and Jesus alone. Man, man will let you down. Because we are all, we're human, we have our flaws, and uh, it wasn't meant for us to be the savior and the hope for other people, even though God can use a person. You know what I'm saying? So make sure that your faith and your trust is in God through Christ Jesus, and he'll never let you down. He'll never leave you. He'll never forsake you. Okay? So I hope that word has encouraged you. Let Jesus be your foundation. Hey, the Bible says that the stone that the builders rejected has now become the cornerstone. You know, that cornerstone on a building, that corner building block or uh, brick, that'd be the strongest point of the building. It's holding up the whole building. So make Jesus your cornerstone, your foundation. All right. Anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed watching. We got nice victory here in the Beaver Chair Dam area. That's right. Hey, I can end it. I can end the season just like this. <laughs> but y'all know that's not that's not the case. Stay tuned because I do need to get to Gator Creek soon, okay? I need to get to Gator Creek. It's been way too long since we've been over there. All right, but anyway, 
I hope you guys have enjoyed watching. Smash that like button for us. Throw a comment in the comment section. Let me know what's on your mind. Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of God the Father. You guys stay blessed. You guys keep encouraged. And as always, we'll see you in the next one. Well, I'll be a monkey's uncle, you guys. <laughs>